Yeah, as you can see, it's on the same place and we'll probably be here for a few more days. So, uh, bikes are uh, ready again. So, <laughs> walk it out. Uh. <laughs> so, we'll probably get the bike ride again to uh, Santa Paul again. There's some, uh, a bit more wind today, so that way is probably the better one to go. It's an easier ride and you're a bit shielded from the wind through the rocks and then the boulevard, it's not really a problem. A lot of people walking uh, uh, today. Uh, just some clouds uh, drifted in. There's been a clear uh, sky all morning, the sun is still out and it's not cold, but yeah. Yeah, Joe Bo uh, just played it. Uh, Two uh, Russian girls, they walked by and they uh, thought uh, <laughs> it was a very nice dog, so, so they even asked if they could take her out for a walk, but nah, <laughs> it's something I don't do. I don't give Bo away her to take a walk with complete strangers. <laughs> and also I don't want uh, the burden of responsibility on especially kids, so uh, yeah. So they just played around here with the ball on the beachy area and uh... yeah new day so uh, let's see yeah I thought I might uh, do uh, my toilet again so this tennis ball uh, bucket is my uh, toilet uh, yeah people following me a bit longer probably seen it before but uh, the like I said the the the, the, the sitting uh, area needs to be uh, exchanged so because yeah this is almost a year on and it's broken now um, so I've got a new like a new pool noodle noodle have to cut that uh, to size and then um, cut it in one size so it's 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 open to uh, put on and then um, fix it with uh, duct tape but uh, it's a tip do it all the way around don't leave any blanks because that's where it breaks first so uh, yeah I'm gonna like it and this one that's where the first breaks just the pieces where there is no duct tape on so um, yeah, I'm gonna do that and then uh, when it's done I'll show you guys how I do it with the bag and uh, everything so but people follow me a bit longer probably seen this before but uh, yeah I didn't uh, show you how I put this in and how it looks like then so I'm gonna do that now yeah the old seat is off now so uh, just the bucket and I put some uh, did that last time put some uh, tape around the edge so it isn't that uh, sharp anymore yeah, and this is the old seat that uh, that came off. It's always um, it's clean thing. It's uh, because you never sit on it because it's in the plastic bag. The plex plastic bag goes over everything, so it's easy with this toy. You'd never ever have to clean it because yeah, you exchange everything that's in contact with uh, with anything. So yeah, yeah I've uh, cut the noodle to size. Now I've got to cut it on one side so it will uh, fit over the over the edge of the bucket. So do that next. I cut it now. For cutting it, I use the little knife on my uh, Swiss uh, pocket knife, and I'll try to show you guys. And yeah. then be careful not to push it really because when you're gonna cut through the other layer then it's yeah it won't keep that long because you already made a cut in it uh, and when it goes on the edge then yeah it's it's gonna go through way uh, way faster so but and i put it on the cupboard so you have it nicely on one side because it's easier to do as from hand and you, you might twist along the side if you know what i mean that it that it runs yeah you want to keep it on one side when you want to fit it on the bucket uh, so I'm gonna do that now yeah the noodle is on you <laughs> see perfect made to measure and uh, now I'm gonna put duct tape on along uh, all the way I'll 
probably start a little bit like here and here and in the middle and then go on and cover it all but uh, I, let's see when you, when you put duct tape on it you compress it a little bit so that it's more dense on the inside so it can withstand pressure a bit longer I guess so uh, yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna do that now the uh, first strategically placed pieces of duct tape are in so uh, now it's just uh, filling it uh, all up for that extra strength and durability so yeah and when you're uh, up uh, to this stage you might think ah oh, it's enough that it will keep yeah of course it will keep it it won't fall off you don't you only need like three pieces to keep it on but really believe me the durability and strength is enormously increased if you just do it all the way around so don't skip out because you'll do way longer with your pool noodle if you completely cover it uh, completely completely covered now in duct tape so make sure it's on everywhere that doesn't stick on the outside so no inside out parts or whatever you can um, put a, um, a trim of duct tape uh, see around here if you want you don't have to but the only thing is you you want to make sure that every piece is on good and it doesn't stick your uh, your, your back your, your where you're lining it with to it so yeah and if you're uh, happy with it uh, it can be uh, lined with the back and get ready for use yeah I thought just just go uh, crazy <laughs> so I did line the whole inside with another layer of uh, of duct tape so it's yeah the, the lining back and uh, doesn't stick anywhere to uh, the ends of the former uh, pieces of uh, duct tape so yeah let's see how long this one uh, keeps the other one uh, kept about a year so yeah I, uh, I promise you guys to show you uh, how this works with putting the bag in now it looks like I believe this is the last one on the roll this is the 60 liters and it's just like a rodent uh, sawdust so uh, yeah I'm gonna need two hands for this so I'm just gonna show you when it's in yeah the lining bag uh, make sure it's uh, completely open and uh, put it in I'll uh, show you guys when it's in now it looks like yeah the bag is on now so just you can see what I mean so everything is covered with the inside of of the of the bag I put the uh, the ends of the bag under the bucket so it stays put and then uh, just take a hand of uh, sawdust and chuck it in there yeah you don't need much sawdust just a little hand because you keep the liquids separated from the from the non liquid so and every, just put everything in so you paper everything just drop it in and then you can uh, tie the bag up and these sexy little bags you at least three times knot them over so you you just knot them over fold the outside in knot it over again outside in knot it over again so three to four times you can knot this bag so it's uh, even if you can't get rid of it right away it won't smell or whatever so uh, yeah so uh, yeah that's um, <laughs> my toilet upgrade again <laughs> It's a shitty subject. <laughs> yeah, and it's, uh, it fits uh, perfectly under the bed, you see? And uh, even when you uh, park up somewhere where you're alone, or if you don't give a... <laughs> you can have a shit with a view. This is warm, eh? Hey, this is warm, eh? Yeah, this is warm, eh? Well, 
ready to leave our little bar back to the camper vans. Look at that, we made an English trifle. It's uh, Twinkies, sponge, sponge um, whipped cream, custard, a fruit, there's raspberries, Blue. blueberries, blackberries. blackberries, banana in there. Yeah, whipped cream on top, uh, grated uh, chocolate. Uh, oh yeah, the cookies are soaked in um, rum with orange juice, or orange juice with rum. And I was still cracking a few walnuts, and uh, it's gonna be nice, is it? <laughs> it's going in the fridge. Yeah. Look at the colors of the sea. The the sun is setting behind us, and it's still shining on the on the clouds, and the colors of the clouds just reflect into the sea. Very beautiful. There is a guy out there with a sailboat. He moved up a little bit. Richard is trying to catch some crabs. <laughs> he might go fishing tomorrow. Look at that trifle. Ooh, very nice. But yeah, I have to eat out of the bowl because we only have two, two bowls. <laughs> Is it nice, people? It's delicious. Delicious? Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> okay, dig in then. Yeah, it's really nice. Really, really, really nice. Mm. I'm enjoying this.